the extraordinary sight of sperm whales fast asleep off the Caribbean island of Dominica, but it is the wonder of their language that scientists are getting really excited about. These two whales are taking turns to communicate in rapid bursts of clicks. Slowed down, they sound like Morse code, with clicks separated by gaps of different lengths. There's so much information coded in the patterns that scientists from a study called Project SETI believe the whales are able to coordinate joint tasks such as foraging for food and rearing their young. We know that their auditory part of their brain is um, very well developed and, and they, they're, they're making these very complex sounds. So it plays a, a huge part of their life, and especially because vision doesn't work as well underwater unless you're really close. So sound is like their eminent mode of, of communication. Whales in the East Caribbean pod identify themselves with two evenly spaced clicks, followed by three in quick succession. But different sequences of clicks have other meanings, and by varying the rhythm and the tempo, there's even more layers of complexity in the calls. Scientists have identified 143 unique combinations they call a sperm whale phonetic alphabet. Right now they are at the very foothills of understanding in terms of how do we get to the point where we could communicate. Is that even possible? Um, we're assuming that they are able to think like us and we like them. And it is analogous to trying to communicate with an alien potentially. Sperm whales have the largest brains of any living creature and are highly social. When they're born, they babble just like human babies before learning their language. Scientists are trying to do the same with artificial intelligence, to understand and one day talk back to the whales. Dr Doolittle may just become reality. Thomas Moore, Sky News.